An open microphone can be dangerous. Heavy, heavy. Heavy is the burden, so I gotta write this To break the silence, I had to fight this Oh, here we go, man, they ain't gonna like this What's really going on? I gotta wonder, man Am I the only one? I don't understand Cause the game ain't the same when the fame and the claim Make a shame to proclaim the son of man We got record sales, videos, and wardrobes Twitter followers, movie deals, award shows Older tears mixed with joys of the newer brethren For more insight, turn to Ezra 211 I got a question that's sure to hit you How do you know if the Lord is with you? How do you know if the Lord has left you? Can't tell about if you're more successful The book of Judges chapter 16, the 20th verse Something was missing, today who's Samson? Who's the Philistines? Anybody else see the guillotine? Christian hip hop got me feeling broken hearted We such a long way off man from where we started We think we winning, but Satan got us out Smarted. I wonder if the glory of God has departed Lord help us before you choose a different squad We need to repent or else we might get the rod I can't call it, it seems like we're sick of God What you call that, huh? Ichabod It's called Ichabod It's called Ichabod What you call that, huh? It's called Ichabod It's called Ichabod It's called Ichabod What you call that, huh? It's called Ichabod the book of Hebrews 2 verse 1 CHH really gotta heed this today We gotta pay close attention to what we heard from the word Otherwise we gonna drift away I think we're seeing that Look at the content A lot of self glory A lot of nonsense Now we drool for the music And fools got a new set of rules Are we losing the contents? We got publicists, platforms, and more shows What's the difference between the mainstream and broad road? Do we want to glorify the Lord anymore? For more insight, turn to 1 Samuel 4. Whatever happened to prayer and fasting? Seeking God's face, not about this rapping. Could it be the devil has found us napping? Are we now happy the crowds are clapping? We exist for the glory of Jesus. Man, we better recognize God don't need us. He can raise rocks up to tell a story. With or without us, who get his glory? Christian hip hop got me feeling broken hearted. We such a long way off, man, from where we started. We think we winning, but Satan got us outsmarted. I wonder if the glory of God has departed lord help us before you choose a different squad we need to repent or else we might get the rod i can't call it it seems like we're sick of god what you call that huh ichabod it's called ichabod it's called ichabod what you call that huh it's called ichabod it's called ichabod it's called ichabod what you call that huh it's called ichabod the art form you're doing here what is it known for in the world. It is known for sin and immorality. It is known to be vile and to cause destruction. But yesterday and today, I saw the same thing happen to a music form that has happened to my life. God has taken it, cleaned it off, made it new, and filled it with life. But let me give you a warning that's very important. As a preacher, I know this, whenever eloquence is more important than the words spoken, there is no power. And whenever a music medium becomes more important than the truth it seeks to communicate, it's useless. It's useless. It's useless. Christian hip hop got me feeling broken hearted. We such a long way off, man, from where we started. We think we winning, but Satan got us outsmarted. I wonder if the glory of God has departed. Lord, help us before you choose a different. Nobody was asking where I've been Cause Christ in the music is no longer the hot trend Logic says, well maybe I should just stop then But I never got into this for a spot in the top ten I do this for one reason Jesus the true king, son To help God's elect obey Hebrews 3.1 And though the rap world is ever crowded If heaven allows it, I'll keep writing for the 7,000 I know you out there, I still get the emails Against the church of Christ, the gates of hell will never prevail It's founded on the rock, and the gospel never stops So we dropping the topic, whether it's popular or not Sin is noxious and toxic and the clock is going to stop God is not to be boxed with the wrath of God is burning hot We were locked in sin's closet, our conflict was cosmic God plotted to stop and hit the demonic with a shot I was copping narcotics, agnostic with a plot No optics for the knowledge of the God who often not Jesus rocked me with the gospel and it tied me up a knot So I hopped in a rocket and met the prophet at the top, yo That's just another way of saying I met God in the scriptures But we just gonna let that breathe for a second, you know what I mean? The Bible says he who has been forgiven much loves much We gonna talk about BC a little bit My depravity was total, not small like pops I was chained to sin, I couldn't take off the locks I thought I 
was a player, a Mac with the flavor, so y'all know what the time is, but I ain't read Isaiah, I would chuckle daily as I paid for disgrace, my eyes were always puffy like I got sprayed with mace, I would toot my horn at parties, and I would do bars, got so intoxicated I was ready to do Mars, notorious for acting pretty silly in my city Philly, friends hear about it and be like, whoa, did he really? Because I played dirty, Bill Lambeer style, through great mercy, spirit filled and dear child, went from so gritty, to headed to a gold city, and Christ I shine, the world's like no biggie, whatever time to sing, I'm putting faith on the song, 112 displayed in John, the way to respond, when his patience runs out, then it's time for the ride, man, microwave wrath of God, fam, that's why because of Christ I got mad joy, all I'm saying is I used to be a bad boy, <laughs> but nowadays I'm regenerated, born again from above, fam, how else can I state it, went from various vices to a kid that's married to Christ, using literary devices to spit it very precise, my conversion to the master was so dramatic, I just wanted to be an ambassador or fanatic, the gospel was my tonic, with Christ I couldn't lose, but to walk with God like Enoch, I knew I couldn't cruise, this walk is a beast, but nothing's greater than the cross, saw the mark of the east, and the Raiders of the laws, while Tower Records was choosing to carry G Unit. I was on that revolutionary theme music. The brothers from the Lou held it down as well. But we noticed the big shift in 2012. Around the time Jackie asked me about Calvinism, Christian hip hop found a different algorithm and crossed over without taking the crossover. Made us all sober. Years later, is it all over? Trip asked me if I was still motivated. I was quiet, but I wanted to say no, I hate it. Cause brothers in your camp causing lots of confusion. I love them as brothers in Christ, but not their conclusions. They want to reach the world by all means, keep pursuing it. But tell me why they got to diss the church while they doing it. That's what I wanted to say, but I ain't say it though. But no more laying low. I want them to play it slow. And I ain't dissing them. My prayers are the proof. Like Boaz without Ruth is unity without truth. CHH is like gorillas in the mist. With no brotherly love, it's like Philly don't exist. What's happening here? It's a different atmosphere. Cats appear most concerned about a rap career. Brothers overseas being slain in the sand while we're vain in our plans seeking fame and some fans and i ain't got time to philosophize satan got a plot device i'm seeing lots of guys apostatize on top of all that donald trump's the president it's all good though because jesus trump's the president so more than ever i'm trying to rep the lord who bled and we ain't never gonna stop word to corey red i'm just trying to give a healthy demonstration of theocentric music for the selfie generation see the problem is sin no riddle in it because all sin got i in the middle of it we're mad to praise and truly evil we need to be born again without a matt damon movie sequel in the gospel god addresses our depravity the lamb slain at calvary the depths of his agony he rose from the grave with abundant grace and when we come in faith he'll bring us up from the sunken place our sins decrepit depths left the mess no rest was left till jesus put death to death the beauty of the victory truly is a mystery the cross of jesus christ is at the nucleus of history before the cross they were saved on credit after the cross we've been saved on debit since our champion in the great war suffered We gon' proclaim his death like the Lord's Supper So welcome to the Still Jesus Project Yo, we just getting started and we got a lot left I am not given to flattery I believe that flattery is a sin A dark sin that does no help to the hearer but I have met with men in the last two days that were men who did not so much have a passion for a style of music as they had a passion for God and the truth of God. And everything without that, absolutely everything that would be done here would be vanity and foolish and useless. But the fact of the matter is, some of the words that I heard spoken here in the songs were truth. The type of truth that this country needs, the type of truth this world needs, the type of truth that the church needs. I came here thinking that I would hear hip hop. I came here thinking that I would hear rappers. I heard preaching. I heard preaching and I heard a respect for the truth and a desire to communicate it. I especially appreciate it for those of my generation who might wander off the street unknowingly and coming to a place like this. I appreciated the words being put on the screen. 
because then even I could understand. I would call what's going on here something that I use quite frequently, the Gideon's call. It seems that God will take the least expected thing and use it for a mighty thing. My whole life has been based on that. God taking the runt of the litter. God taking that which is not, that which is despised, that which is unable, and using it and filling it with the power of God. Let's look at this for a moment. Every one of us who is Christian was found by God to be vile. And our best works was not, were nothing more than filthy rags. But He saved us and He cleaned us and He uses us as instruments for His glory in such a way that even angels long to trade places with us. The art form you're doing here, what is it known for in the world? It is known for sin and immorality. It is known to be vile and to cause destruction. But yesterday and today, I saw the same thing happen to a music form that has happened to my life. God has taken it, cleaned it off, made it new, and filled it with life. But let me give you a warning that's very important. As a preacher, I know this, whenever eloquence is more important than the words spoken, there is no power. And whenever a music medium becomes more important than the truth it seeks to communicate, it's useless. Now, I didn't see that here. I, I stayed up last night till almost three in the morning with a group of men. And I was absolutely amazed. I couldn't even sleep this morning because I was saying, Lord, what a privilege it was for me to be in the midst of a group of young men that you're raising up that believe the ancient ways. They're saying the exact same truth and they're speaking to a people that Spurgeon could not reach and Edwards could not reach, Whitfield could not reach. I applaud what's being done here. I came here only to be a spectator, to see, God, are you in any of this? But in the hearts of the men and the words of the music, I am greatly, greatly encouraged. I'll only warn you, it is so hard to be a true preacher of the gospel, and it is so hard to live out the truth that we proclaim to others. But that is the task for every one of you who rap, for every one of you involved in this, you have a special stewardship from God. You must be holy. You must follow Him. Don't you know that because of what you're doing, people, even good Christians, are waiting and looking for you to fall. They're looking for you to do something that will prove that this was not a medium chosen by God.